interested in following us this far? Unfortunately, yes. And it's you they're after, young lady. We already knew that. But I would like to know why he's so interested in her. I'm sorry, but I do not know the exact reasons. Valar never shares his motives with the Bloodseekers. He is content just to give them orders. Bloodseekers? <laughs> is that what he calls his men? I remember that that's what the imposter Yorn shouted when he got them to attack us. Indeed. Yon was one of Valar's best lieutenants. It was he that our army was chasing when we were traveling north. You haven't told us how you succeeded in finding us after that. Indeed. I covered our tracks and I killed Yorn with my own hands. We came across his camp, which had been destroyed. We found a survivor there who told us of you. But even knowing which direction to travel in, it wasn't easy tracking you down. Listen, I don't care what you think you already know about Falar. He has become a powerful man. Luckily for us, I was able to warn Lord Halton of his plans in time. My lord sent men to our rescue. And how many are you exactly? Too few. Did you hear that outside? While we were speaking, Valar's advance guard surrounded the house. But they didn't realize that my own men had secretly surrounded them. As we speak, Valar's men are being attacked from every angle. Now, if you wish to live, you must fight alongside us to help my men drive them back. If Valar's main forces arrive before we can escape, we won't have a chance. And how would we accomplish that? Well, if all goes well, we will have enough time to escape by the river. It's the only route quick enough, if we're to escape. Enough words. Let our swords do the talking. Jane, we're going outside. Barricade the doors as best you can behind us. I'll make sure of it. Please, be careful.
Nothing more than scum. I'm gonna slaughter the whole lot of you. 